guys, it's Terry. Welcome back to my channel, Southern Yankee. This is gonna be a short but sweet video. I have the Jeffree Star uh, glosses. I am at a different angle in my living room because I'm using the natural light coming in from the back doors, even though it's raining out. But I think you can really see um, my eye look I just did looks pretty dang good. Um, so Jeffree Stars, they come in his, you know, iconic pink, boxes they are embossed it says the gloss on them and on the bottom it has a i like when they do this then it has a color of the color you're going to wear and this is spank me now i did get four different glosses i do have a plumping gloss that's been on my lips for i don't know 20 minutes and i'm kind of sweaty because i was cleaning but um the first color is one of my favorites that i'm about to show you where's the box um, this is in the color wet peach and here it is and it is beautiful it has like coral and peach tones and it looks like sort of pink and gold reflective glitter in it now you may have seen all of these swatched on my Instagram I had them swatched on my hand on my story for a little bit some of you might have saw that so and you've got your um, it's got like pink here and it's gold I feel like all his all of his stuff has weapons on it. We had a pointy star and pointy thing here. You just stab somebody. Anyway, um, but I um, have worn some of these glosses, not all of them. And so I'm gonna do a quick show of what they look like on. And then I'm going to and um, go ahead and give you my review on what I actually think about them. So this is Wet Peach. And as you can see, it does have some color, very light color. Okay, there is wet peach. It's hard to see up close that it really does have some glitter in it, but I can see it. I don't think that's coming across on camera though. So um, it's not sticky. It's very nice. Okay, so there's wet peach. And we're gonna take our handy dandy wipe and wipe our lips and start over. There it is. The color came off. Okay. And the next color, we'll do Spank Me kind of last. This is Crystal Climax, this next one. And this one is sort of a bronze, it's definitely bronze and gold reflect. And this is another one that is going to have some color to it. I have worn this one, I like it. And there is Crystal Climax. I like this color. I think this color is fantastic for the fall. I think it's great. It's sheer enough with just enough coverage. Like if you're not a lipstick wearer, I think you'll really like this color. But all of your neutral colors, if you're somebody who wears tans and whites and browns, this is a great color and when fall comes i know i'm gonna wear the heck out of this i'm actually right now because i was sweating i changed and i'm wearing a top this looks great with it it almost comes off like a nude um like a beautiful nude but with a gloss sheen, sheen. let me pull you in a little bit more so it doesn't have any of that you know where the glop it sticks doesn't have any of that crystal climax hopefully this will help you guys if you want to get these yourself well, let's the next one we are going to do is the one he tried on himself this is called her glossiness 
okay, I had to clean my lips off. So this is her glossiness. Now this has like orange, green, and gold reflex in it. And this is the one that Jeffrey tried on in his video. Now those different green colors really are not picking up here. Hopefully you'll get to see them on the lips. There, you can kind of see the green. And if I were going to wear these out, I would pair them with a nude liner. but I wanted you to see just really what they look like on the lips. This one, you really can see the glitter, her glossiness. This one is really fun and it's unique and you can use these again. This looks like a really great nude, but a gloss. So if you're a gloss girl, you'll love this. And if you're a nude girl, you'll love this. definitely see the glitter in this. I really like this color a lot. And the final color that we have is Spank Me. This is a bright fuchsia pink. Look at that. This is not going to match my look today, but it's okay. <laughs> look at all the glitter. Now, I did not get the sheer formula. I got the glitter formulas. It says on the box that there are two finishers, Glitter Fantasy and Extreme Shine. So I got Glitter Fantasy in all. I did not get the Extreme Shine. Um, so I can't give you a review on those. I just didn't like those as much in, this, in the models. So, but I liked these and I thought this would be a good one for summer for all my bright summery looks. So hang tight, I'm gonna get this off and we'll be back. Okay, lips are clean and ready. Her, and this is Spank Me. Again, a liner is a must. <laughs> especially for me because I have lines. Okay, and there is Spank Me. And you can see the glitter. Oh, right there too. And that spanked me. All right, I'm going to actually put her glossiness back on because I think it worked well with my look. I'll be back with my final thoughts on Jeffree Star's new The Gloss. Okay, guys, and here is her glossiness over a with a, a nude um, liner. I hope you guys love this. So my final thoughts. I have had uh, some time to play with the glosses. Um, I've wore a couple of them. I've worn Spank Me, I wore, uh, and Wet Peach. I hadn't worn the, the brown, this one and um, the other one. And I did wear them alone and the Wet Peach I did wear over a, um, over a lipstick. That look lasted almost all day. A lot of times I'll keep these at my desk so when I feel like the gloss is coming off I can reapply. I did not have to uh, reapply wet peach even after lunch. It was still there. Even after I ate, it, it kind of came off gracefully and it looked nice and I really liked it. So you will have to reapply them. I mean, they're glosses. So if you are drinking or eating or something like that, you are gonna have to reapply them. But overall, I really like the gloss formula. It is not sticky at all. It is very comfortable. I mean, you can tell you're wearing a gloss, but it's so light and it's so comfortable. So. Um, I got them directly on Jeffree Star's website, but I think if you're going to get um, a couple of them, I would go to the Beautylish website because I think 
Beautylish offers. A, Beautylish sends you a free gift every time you order, especially if you're a first timer. I think I got micellar water, um, which by the way was amazing. So you can go there, sign up, um, and get a free gift when you order. And then also I think orders over $35 ship free. So if you buy a couple glosses, you'll get free shipping. So I'd go to Beautylish to get these and I will link that below for you. So um, I know I'm new to Beautylish. Um, uh, some of you may not have ever heard of it. Here, I feel like we're too close. Let's let's back out a little bit. So um, so I'll put all that information down below. I'll also put Jeffree Star's website too. You might want to check it out. But Beautylish does have some of his other stuff up. And he's actually coming out with another launch of a um, Jawbreaker. I think I took some pictures. I'll put them up here. That's coming out like June 21st or 22nd. I may get one of the palettes. Let me know if you're interested in those palettes. I'd just be curious if you're interested in his launch. And you know, I've had people make some comments here and there about, oh, I don't like this person or that person. I don't care about the drama that's going on in the world with that stuff. My only thing is to say, do I recommend the product? Do I like the product? Jeffree Star stuff is all cruelty free, which I do, I do like, and it's good. It's good. I have his palettes and I like them. I have his setting powder and his um, concealer. I like that too. Um, so I am just simply reviewing what the product is, not the person behind the brand. So if you are interested in that and you would like to see one of the Jawbreaker palettes reviewed, let me know. I'm not gonna buy his whole collection because he's launching a massive, massive collection with like new liquid lips and um, new highlighters, new highlighter palettes, the Supreme Frost, um, a big massive palette and then a mini palette and then a highlighter palette. So um, I'm not gonna get all of that, but I will get a couple things if you wanna see the review, but I need you to tell me if you wanna see that, please comment down below. Um, if you have tried the glosses, let me know what your favorite gloss is and if you plan on trying them or not. So I'll see you guys all in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this. Have a wonderful day.